Hey, my name is Nate Becker, and I'm answering Dr. B's Week 12 uh, discussion board prompt, which is uh, describing our best and worst bosses. I'm going to go ahead and start off with the bad and say that I was working at Applebee's as my very, very first job as a server, and it all started off pretty well until I realized that our manager on duty most of the time was coming in hungover or had been drinking before she came in at least. And obviously that would be a problem because she'd get in our way and start yelling and be kind of embarrassing as a whole um, restaurant because she would be all over the place and not really helping out. Um, she also had a kid that she would bring in and whenever she couldn't find cover to help take care of the kid, she'd kind of just set it on the expo station and let us help her um, take care of her. But... Um, then our general manager, which would come in um, every once in a while, they wouldn't really do anything about it. They'd kind of just tell her to go home. And I think they were giving her the benefit of the doubt and just letting her sleep it off or whatever, but she didn't really want to be there in the first place. Um, moving on to my better bosses, uh, I had a job at a winery in Pilot Mountain, and I've also been working at an oyster bar here, which I think that these two owners slash bosses I've had have been very, very hands-on. Um, they're pretty much there every weekend, every um, busy shift that we have. They're there if we need help in the kitchen, they're hands-on in the kitchen. If we need help in the dish pit, they're hands-on in the dish pit. And um, not even just speaking at work, even after work, um, he'll ask to, you know, have a drink or, like, uh, talk to him and we'll have very like genuine conversations. He asks if we're okay and like if everything's good at home, all that stuff. And I feel like he's just a very genuine person and a very good boss because he doesn't just want to pay you. He wants to know if you're okay and he wants the best for his company. So he wants us to want the best. And by us seeing that he's very hands-on and there and apparent, I think it really helps everyone as a whole kind of work together and make the whole work environment much, much better for everybody involved. But thank you and have a good one.